Okay, I switched to a Grass Hero swim jig because this pond is way too, um, has way too much weeds for the chatterbait. So, hopefully I can get one. First cast. Okay. Well, that's a little guy, but first cast on a swim jig. Little bass. <sighs> Hopefully that's gonna be one of many. Oh! <laughs> okay. Oh, it came off. Oh my gosh, it bit again. Okay, I'm 100% getting it this time. Or not. Oh, it's really small, that's why. It's so small that it can barely, like, get half of this swim jig in its mouth. Okay. Never mind. Okay, that's another one on the swim jig. Just get him up on the grass. It's probably a two pounder. Hey, buddy, chill out. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, probably around two pounds, maybe a little under. Okay, let's keep going. There's so many little baits in here. This hydrilla is really good for breeding bait. But the only problem is there is nowhere near enough room for the bass to get through it all. Little guy. Okay, that's number three on the swim jig. Yeah, that's a really little one. <sighs> There's so much little bluegill and stuff up shallow. Seems like a good one. Oh yeah. It's like a two and a half, three. I think. He's getting down in the weeds.
Oh, that that's a, that's a really good one. Okay. Probably three and a half. Nope. Stop. Oh, jeez, I really underestimated that. That might be close to four. Okay. Oh yeah, that's definitely four. Hold on, I'm gonna weigh that. It's like, that's a good one. On the grass hero. It's probably my favorite swim jig. He's, he's hooked. Weird. Okay, I'd have to guess that that thing's close to four, or maybe four and a half. He's got a really big head. My scale is so bad. Okay, there we go. On, zeroed out. Let's see. Oh, wow. Okay then, <laughs> I was way, way underestimating that thing. It's 413, almost a five pounder. Wow, that's a good one on the swim jig. Jeez, when it bit, I thought it was half the size. Stuff on my GoPro, hopefully this the oh no. Well, I just stepped in a bed that was two feet deeper than the rest of the area. Oh god. Now I have so much crap in my boots. So much water in my boots. Well that sucks, but that was a good fish. Okay. Well, just got that nice one, and now my foot is soaking wet. That's another good one. Okay, that one's more like two and a half, three. Oh no, he might have just came off in there. Yep, crap. <laughs> There might be like a school right here because that was pretty quick. It was two casts in a row. Oh, that just guy, that guy just got pond water in my mouth. Ah. Okay. Ow. It's probably a one. Little guy. Can you stop? Yeah, these bass are definitely post-spawn. Skinny, all spawned out. Are their tails... Eh, their tails aren't really messed up. I almost just threw that guy on top of the tilapia. <laughs> yeah. The the bottom oh, around this lake is mostly sand, so when they're spawning, their tails don't get too messed up from digging the beds. Oh, it's, it's hot out here today and I forgot a drink. Okay, my GoPro's dead now. <laughs> 